Hello there, this is Yinka Ojo, again on Guy Talk. I, this time around, I've brought for you the prophetic word of the Lord for the month of October. And I have written it down here. It's going to be a beautiful, wonderful month for you. And I want you to listen attentively, take your pen, if possible, and write down what the Lord himself is saying. The word of the Lord, God's, I heard the Lord say, the siege is over. The stalemate has been turned around in your favor. No more delay. You will not be stranded. Forward movement, progress and acceleration has come. Lift up your hands in praise for what you waited for has finally arrived. That's good news. God is saying what you have waited for for so long has finally arrived. This is the month. Oh, yes. And the Lord is saying the siege is over. There are some of you, you have been facing some battles and uh, it's like you are not moving forward. You're not going backwards. But the Lord says that the stalemate is now being turned around in your favor. You are a winner. You will testify. Things will turn out in your favor. This is the month for you to experience that. God is talking about forward movement here. He's talking about progress. He's even saying he's granting you acceleration in this month of October. Come on, lift your hands and receive it in Jesus' name. Then the word of the Lord continues. It's a month of good reports, but you must testify of my goodness. Many of my children that I have blessed have kept the story to themselves. Share the testimonies with others and watch me multiply the miracles in your life. So God is saying here that he wants you to testify. He, there are so many things he has done. Goodness, blessings of the Lord that has happened in many of our lives, but we have not shared it. The Bible says that we overcome the devil by the blood of the Lamb and the word of our testimony. When the woman with the issue of blood was healed, Jesus demanded that she share that testimony. When you share your testimony, God is saying he will multiply the miracles. He will multiply the blessings. He will multiply the benefits in your life. Uh, even if it means just to your neighbor or somebody that you live with, share with them. And then as you begin to do that, it will encourage the person you share it with. But also God says, I will also multiply miracles in your life because a miracle shared, a testimony shared, is a seed that you've planted towards bigger harvest of testimonies to come your way. So God is saying it's a month in which you will have good reports, but you must be willing to testify. Because when God blesses you, listen, when God blesses you, he has more than you in mind. He has other people in mind too for blessing you. So keep that in mind. Then the Lord's word goes on to say, there will be exposures of cover-ups this month. So God is saying that he's going to expose things this month. As you see me expose evildoers and workers of, of darkness, do not fear. For as the iniquity of the Amorites became full in my word, thereby attracting judgment, so shall the judgment come upon unrepentant evildoers. But my people who walk in my ways shall be blessed and they shall be protected and they shall be kept under the shadow of my wings. So God is saying something about the month of October. It's going to be a peculiar month. It's going to be a, a, an interesting month in the sense that it's going to be a good month for the children of God, but it's going to be a month that the devil will regret. So God is saying that those who are on the devil's side, he's going to do a lot of removal of cover-ups. He, there's going to be a lot of exposure of evildoers. There's going to be a lot of exposure of workers of darkness and iniquity. That the cup of many evil workers in the land, in your country, their cup will be full this month of October and God will cause their works to be no more. And so God says judgment is coming upon the devil. Judgment is coming upon his courts. Judgment is coming upon evildoers if they do not repent, the human beings. Judgment will come upon unrepentant evildoers. Oh yeah, so God is saying that, listen, it's time to get off doing evil. He will, re he will forgive if you repent, of course. Then, but God said, but my people, this is the one that concerns you and I, but my people who walk in my ways shall be blessed and they shall be protected. They shall be kept under the shadow of my wings. I love that. God is saying, I will not leave you unattended to. Oh yeah, there may be fearful things come upon those who are doing evil. But you that is walking and living righteously, 
you that is working and living for God, God says you, are, you have nothing to fear. You have nothing to worry about. All you have to do is know that you dwell in the secret place of the Most High and that you abide under the shadow of the Almighty. Listen, God is saying that under his wings, he has kept you covered in the month of October. And then the word of the Lord goes on to say, God says, keep your focus on me. Keep your gaze fastened on my face. I will move you higher. You will climb from glory to glory. This month, you will be lifted up to higher grounds by my spirit, says the Lord. Wow, I love that. God's word says, keep your focus on me. Keep your gaze fastened on me. The Bible says, looking unto Jesus, the author and finisher of our faith. Don't look at the distractions to the left, to the right. Keep on moving ahead. Keep on going on with God. Keep your focus on his word. What he has promised he will do for you this month in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. And God says, I will move you higher. Woo! I believe your season of promotion has come. I believe your season of elevation is here. That's what God is saying. And God said, I will move you higher. You will climb from glory to glory this month. Woo! Say it out loud. I will climb from glory to glory this month. And then God says, I will lift you up to higher grounds by my spirit, said the Lord. Listen, it's not by our might, it's not by our power, but by the spirit of the Lord. Say after me, I will keep my focus on the Lord in this month. I will keep my gaze fastened on my Savior. I will move higher and higher in God. I will climb from glory to glory. This is my month. The Lord is lifting me higher to higher grounds by his spirit in Jesus' name. Amen. Let me pray for you. Father, I pray for my brother, my sister, as they are listening to this and watching in this month of October. Lord God, let there be great and mighty manifestations of your goodness, of your power, of your presence like never before in Jesus' mighty name. I pray that they will testify. Month of October will prosper you. I speak to the land, the sea, and the air to cause uh, the blessing of God to rain down upon your life uh, and you will celebrate. Remember to testify. Remember to share what God is doing in your life with other people and God will multiply it. Well, this is Nikao Joe giving you the prophetic word for October. Like this, share this, follow and make sure that you comment. Until I come your way next time in my next video, keep on soaring, especially throughout this month of October. Bye.